Tom, that video captures the moment Nicole Reitz's car pulled off of the El Greco parking lot. It was the latest in a string of misfortunes for the hardworking waitress. All right, 535, you have a wonderful night. She's trying to keep a happy face with customers. All right, and your waitress will be right over for you. But Nicole Reed is still looking for the young man police say stole her car as she served customers December 30th. I had my back turned in the other waitress right here, and I was sitting here telling her about the whole menu. Three young men came inside, asked for a restroom, but they never ordered. They left, and suddenly Nicole's car was gone. As I was leaving that table, I happened to look outside and see my car was not there. Instead, the restaurant's camera captures video of the trio making a beeline, but not to the bathroom, to Nicole's car and taking off. One even appears to be well under 18. I was mad. I was pissed. These little kids, they want to do stupid stuff and then they make things even worse for people. Italian for both. Okay. It's been a tough month for this mother of three who lost her own mother weeks ago, and she was forced out of her home, then this. To the point where I don't know how much more I can take, because it's like as much as I do, it's just something always bring me back down. I got three kids. I got to take them to and from school. I got to take them to and from daycare. I got to go to work. As for the people who took her car. What type of person did they take from? Hardworking mother of three that puts all her time and energy for her kid that just wants to make a better life for my kid. And a message for their parents. If the parents see their kid on the news, they should be embarrassed about their kid and they should turn their kid in. Police say the car was recovered and the people responsible for the thefts are still out there. If you have any information about these three, you're asked to give police a call. Reporting in studio, Tony Atkins, today's TMJ4.